Hello, how is everyone doing? I am here today to share with you two of my new journals. Um, these will be available in my Etsy shop and I will go through them. They're basically the same. One has like a little ruffle at the bottom and the other one doesn't. And I made this out of a quilt that I literally begged my mom for for about a year. And she finally gave it to me. It's just this really beautiful purple and green flowers quilt. So pretty. So I'll go through both journals so that you can see them and then um, they will be in my Etsy shop if you're interested. So here is the first one. There's the sweet little ruffle at the bottom and the heart. And these measure, let's see, this one is about six and a half by 10. So when you open it up, there's lots of goodies in this one. And this is like a soft cover. So you can put lots of pictures and things and fill it up. And there's lots of room for your journal to grow. So let me go through this little thing because I know you guys like to see the goodies that are in all the little pockets. So here's some cool ephemera that I thought you could use for the journal. There's a journaling card, a little, another little journaling card, another little journaling card, a little tag thing that you can journal on. And then in this little envelope, there's a bunch of goodies that you can use for your journal. And I'll show you. There is a butterfly button. There's actually two butterfly buttons. Some fabric, and I thought you could use this for like the tabs or something or a pocket. Some pretty little flowers. Some lace. Um, this you can use to embellish a page somewhere. So you can literally, you know, just put it on the side or use it for embellishing. This is a little cluster that you can use somewhere in your journal. A butterfly sticker. And here are some of my angel stickers that I created that are in my shop as well. Some tags. A big tag that you can journal on and another little journaling card. Oop. So that is all the goodies in this pocket in the front. Okay, so that is what's in this front pocket. Lots of little things to play with. And then this kit, and I printed this out on presentation paper so the color really pops and it's really pretty. Um, is my pretty purple layers kit and that is also in my um, Etsy shop. So I'll just kind of flip through and show you everything. Here is a tag in a little um, wax paper bag or a wax bag with napkin, a pretty linen, I actually got this linen in Johanna's shop. She's got some really pretty linens. And I'll put all of the links in the description box. Some pretty paper, some more pretty paper, some ledger paper, and there's plenty of room in this journal to write, which is always good. Um, this I dyed with, um, food coloring. Pretty coffee dyed paper. Tea dyed paper. And the other side of that linen. And here is a little collaged pocket that I did. And I love these little flowers. I got these from somebody on Etsy. She does such a cute job. Um, I will find that and link it in the description box. And here is a journaling card that my dad made. 
It says heart and soul, and it has one of my little trees on it. He's so cute. He makes the cutest little journaling cards. Okay, and that's the first signature. Look how bright these colors are on that paper. Isn't that pretty? And then this is the second signature. There are four signatures. Here's a pretty linen. Here's a little cluster and some cool journaling cards with coffee dyed paper on the back so you can journal on them. And then a collaged pocket and here is a journaling card that I made and it says choose happy. Some lace, some pretty paper, some pretty tabs, gorgeous coffee dyed paper. This is in my kit, a pocket, and there will be more goodies in this little pocket too, but that will be a surprise. And then here is a collaged pocket with this cool little notebook of paper that you can write in, and then a pretty tag with coffee dyed paper on the back. This paper right here, my friend Nancy gave to me. Is that not the prettiest? She did a good job. She makes really pretty papers. And then that's the second signature. And then here is the third signature. This pretty linen that is in Johanna's shop as well. And this pretty paper, coffee dyed. And this paper I made with my parents, and this is um, food coloring. And we just splashed it on there and made all different kinds of designs. Thought that was pretty cool. And then here's the collage pocket with a journaling card that I made. It says everything has beauty with coffee dye paper on the back and then another little journaling card. And they've both been sewn around. And then here's another coffee dyed paper, ledger paper, tea dyed paper, Here are two more journaling cards in a pretty little um, pocket. And this is in my digital kit, pretty purple layers. And then here is the last signature and it has this pretty linen. I love writing on these linens, it's really pretty coffee dye paper, these pretty little tabs. I've embellished these tabs. Here are two journaling cards. This one says, Be Brave. And it's got coffee dye paper on the back. And then this is just a little card that you can journal in. And then this is just a collaged pocket that has been embellished. Some lace. I really like this lace, it's got hearts on it. It's really pretty. This is like a tea dyed paper, doily dyed paper, ledger paper, doily dyed coffee paper. Really pretty. And then here is a belly band. And here's another one of those little flowers that I bought on Etsy. And I cannot think of the name of her shop, but I'll put it in the description box. She's got cute stuff. And here is two journaling cards that I made. This one says, choose to shine. And this one says, go where your heart takes you. And that is the last signature. And then here is the writing board. 
And if you don't know what a writing board is, it's just something that you can have in your journal. So no, no matter where you are, you can just stick it behind a piece of paper and have something to press down on while you write. So it's kind of a cool thing to have. And that is the first journal. And it's soft, so there's like lots of room to build. If you put pictures in it, you've got plenty of room. So that is that one. And I'm just going to go through this one fairly quickly because it's basically the same. It is, does not, the only thing different, it doesn't have the ruffle at the bottom. It has this beautiful heart, just gorgeous. And then it has a uh, envelope full of goodies and more ephemera in the front. I won't go through that because it's exactly the same as the first one, but you get a journaling card, a couple journaling cards, things that you can use throughout this journal. And I'll just kind of flip through this pretty quick because it's basically the same as the other one. There might be tiny differences like the type of coffee dyed paper or something like that. And here, look at this. That's another one of those flowers that um, that lady made. So pretty. And here is one of my dad's journaling cards. He's so creative. It says, own your story. He actually did a video of making this journaling card and you can catch that. That's in my um, playlist under dad's videos. And then here is the second signature. There's lots of goodies in here, but there's also plenty of room for you to create what you want to create, which I like. And here is a journaling card I created that says take risk. And this sweet little collage and the pretty tab. And this paper right here, um, my friend Nancy made that. It's so pretty and it's on thick paper. So this is gonna be really fun to journal on. Another linen and here is a little booklet with lots of cool papers that you can play with. And another one of those cool flowers. Look at this paper. Is that not gorgeous? So pretty. It's got like flowers. Really pretty. And in this pocket is a journaling card that says live simply, give generously. And then a little tag that you can journal in. And my friend Nancy also made this. And I'm not really sure how she did that. It looks like she might have used like some different kinds of inks and some shimmery stuff, but it is so pretty. So, so pretty. And a little pocket, and this will have some goodies in it too for whoever buys this journal. Here's the other side of that beautiful paper. I thought it fit this journal really well. This beautiful um, linen. And then here are some journaling cards that I made. It says, fall in love with as many things as possible. And this one says, never give up. And then this is just a little collaged pocket that says, choose to see the good stuff. And this is the last signature. There's some vellum. I love this. This is that Tim Holtz vellum. I love that big butterfly. Some doily coffee dyed paper. Another pretty linen. Here's a pocket with two journaling cards in it. 
This one says, great things take time. And this one says, live, create, tell the story. And look at this, isn't that pretty? And some pretty tabs, pretty paper, a pretty journaling card, and another one of those sweet little flowers. Coffee dye paper, the other side of that vellum. And then this is presentation paper. And then here is the writing board. And here's the back. And these papers are in my digital kit called Pretty Purple Layers in my Etsy shop. Okay, that is these two journals. They will be available in my Etsy shop, Heather Wilkerson Art. I hope everyone is doing really, really well, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.